Hi, this is Barb with the Tech Teach Grow team with another tip of the week. When you have a Google Slide, Google Doc, Google Sheet, anything that you want to continue using um, year after year or multiple times but don't want to make a copy, which is what we're encouraging because if you've shared that link out with anybody, if you make a copy, it will break the link. Um, and also if it's linked on any websites or anything like that, you have to go and update it. However, if you just go in and um, edit things and change the version history, then you can use the same document over and over again. So right here I have a show your work slideshow and I'm going to go to file and then we're going to go to version history and we're going to see version history. If you utilize this feature, then you can update any of your previous versions and name them. So let's say back in September, I, you know, I look at the version and I only had one slide and I'm going to actually name this version something different. And we're going to call this one problem. Um, and that's for if there's one problem. So this one is specifically to Unifix cubes. We could also do one problem with Unifix cubes. So now I know that this particular version is going to be with one problem in Unifix cubes. I can go to my current version and realize that this is a bunch of slides about uploading pictures of work. So I might rename this one uploading pictures. Pictures of work. And now it um, is saved as that. If um, I want to go back to my one problem with Unifix cubes, I can click on that version and go to restore this version, press restore. And now if I go to my version history, we will see it again. So now I have one problem with Unifix cubes, uploading pictures of work. And now my current version is back to that previous one. This is very helpful if you have things that you're going to use year after year. Um, with this, you can then have a generic label for the actual document. So now this is just a show your work. And then I can name all those different versions for the different types of ways students can show their work. Um, hope this was helpful.